Okay. Hi friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be watching Spy Family episode 3. Um, this is the prep for the interview episode, which I know is going to be very fun. It's also where I finally have Anya, Lloyd, and Yor, sorry, <laughs> in living in the same house and seeing how that transition will be and what um, Anya is going to think of having a mom finally. So let's just get started with the episode. But before we do, I would like to invite you to subscribe to my channel if you enjoy the content that I put out. As well, I also invite you to follow me on my social media accounts. All the links are in my description as well as links to my Annie list to find out what shows I've been watching or are planning to watch, as well as to my Goodreads to find out what manga I've been reading. Also, there's some links that you could visit if you would like to support me and my channel. Okay, I think that's all I wanted to say. Um, let's just get started. Everyone has a side, they don't show anyone else. Yeah, this this was like the representative of this family, like that image. That was really cool. Oh my goodness, Lloyd. Master of disguise. His daughter Anya. And his wife Yor. Our wife Yor. Yor with her hair down. And Lloyd in those shirts. Oh, they knew what you wanted. They gave us a close up. But there's the. <laughs> They'll share one for appearances for when they have guests. Welcome to Anya's house. Rather unusual family. The father, Lloyd Forger, is a psychiatrist. His true identity is a spy, codename Twilight. The mother, your forger, is a civil servant who works at City Hall, but her true identity is an assassin. Her codename is Thorg Princess. And their adorable daughter is Anya, who's a telepath. They got their marriage certificate backtracked like a year. I mean, makes sense. Yeah, like... Oh, that's right, they gotta let... Yuri. That's true. If the school saw that they recently got married, they would su suspect that like they only got married for um, like to get past the interview. A tour. Oh, do you see those mugs? The green ones, Lloyd's. The red one is Anya because it's smaller, and they're gonna add a new one. For your, I can't. Camera. Are you kidding me? Oh, I like the interior. Isn't that the seat that your is like sitting on for her cover, like the volume two cover, like that red chair? <laughs> Lloyd with his hair down. I mean, Lloyd, both Lloyd and Yor with their hair like down. It's so. He didn't even make it down the hallway, and Lloyd, I mean, Yor's already finished. They're not showing Yuri's face yet. Understandable. I guess they're going shopping. Are her weapons. <laughs> oh, look at these cookies. This is gonna be like their family thing having tea or coffee and snacks. Oh, 
Anya gets her own little like tiny chair. Oh, he's back to business. How do you spend your days off? Papa orders me to stay home. So I have to watch TV all alone. <laughs> Why'd you choose Eden Academy? Perhaps passing? Does she mean passing like dying? You're scaring your daughter. Methods? Strike first. <laughs> this is the first time he's seriously considering that he might fail this, this mission. Mm. Did you see that? Yeah, you guys gotta get some experience for his being a family. Outing? Outing? For outing? Oh! Anya is very entertained by his mom. By her mama, sorry. <laughs> the one time she hugged him too hard, I ended up breaking two of his ribs. <laughs> Poor Yuri. <laughs> oh, it's okay, you are. They went to the opera house. Choppy chopped. Your the guillotine. <laughs> she <laughs> okay. Time for a little break. I love Anya's like little commentary <laughs> and sound effects. If Mama and Papa sees, they'll find out about my powers. Oh, but she's trying to hide it. <laughs> See, you managed to hide your secret from mom and papa. Good job. That's where they that's where they met. Oh, she's so excited. I can't. This is so cute. So they get their clothes like Blood splatters. <laughs> they must be proud that yours finally found herself a husband. Having a child is an instant no. She always has to get her dress tailored there because it gets ruined in missions. You're taking a family portrait? Oh, Anya's like. I love it when Anya just grabs. Why are they both so tense? Patriotism. Oh, all of these thoughts are not making Anya feel good. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Is she just eating the peanuts? Your <laughs> Oh no, Lloyd is stressed. Don't mind. <gasps> no, you didn't. You picked the perfect child. I get why your I mean your I keep getting them mixed up. I get why Lloyd is stressed. Because this is, if you really think about it, it's, this is a dangerous mission. And of course, he doesn't know the other two secrets. So he doesn't want to put the pressure of this mission onto ordinary civilians. Look at how Lloyd's holding Anya. Of course, so that she doesn't fall. 
Look at Anya swinging her little legs. Oh, that's her stature. There she goes. There she goes. I mean, her nose is bleeding? Yeah. There, she, she heard you. Good job, Anya! It's like leading Lloyd's vision to where he, that person actually is walking to, but not necessarily pointing him out. Oh! Boom! Nice. That spy was not bring attention to him though. <laughs> Please call the police and hand him over. Okay, bye! <laughs> her... her husband! Her husband! <laughs> Grandma's so cute. Hero who casts no shadow. So then all the the things they do never get noticed. Oh. Oh yeah, like it's nice to to be appreciated for your hard work. Once in a while. Oh. They're both blushing. <laughs> They are they true. Yes, grandma. Let them know. Mission's not a failure, Lloyd. They just They get along so well. So here we go, we're back to the interview prep. We go to the opera, the museum and eat a restaurant. Nice. Chop on top of them, beat them up, make them eat the fullest meal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lloyd, Lloyd blushing. Okay, if someone recognizes you guys as a lovely family, that is a step in the right direction. 1%. I mean, it's still progress. The ending? Yo, this ending is so... Oh, and all the characters we're gonna meet. It's... Oh... First, it's the two of them, and then they add Mama, and then they're, and then it's the three of them together. And they're all dancing together. I can't. And now they're having a meal, and they put Anya to bed. <laughs> Here we go. Next episode is. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh my God. I'm truly looking forward to next week's episode. This episode was so much fun. Ah, the the the, the outing, them getting to spend time together, and of course, the them working together to catch that um, first natural. They're such a lovely family, and I, I get I get the stress of Lloyd. I get why he's feeling stress, but I'll, but also like. He's always worked alone, and in his mind, he's working with an ordinary little girl, an ordinary orphan, and like a civil servant. Like obviously, I know Lloyd is stressed because he has to, he really has to get this um, 
get this spot like Anya has to get into the to the academy so he's just he was stressed so I understand why he was stressed but you know it, it was it was nice for him like to have that little moment at the end thanks to grandma I was kind of like you guys look like a lovely family and Aiden Academy is all about having you know like a child coming from a a, a family with good morals and good foundation so for grandma to acknowledge what a lovely family they are that's that's a good thing um i love how welcoming anya was to your she, she gave your a tour she introduced your to her dear friend mr camera and Anya is very affectionate to both Yor and Lloyd and in turn they are also very affectionate to her it's just they work so well together all three of them I'm so I have a lot of love for the forgers I have so much love for the forgers and this episode was just it was a fun time and we got really got to see how quickly they like each a adapted to um this new family situation they're in and i understand like for lloyd he's been in multiple cases where you know he's had to get along with people that like in a quick manner my understanding also of anya like this is something that she's dreamed of this is something that she's always wanted she comes from a very like her background is tragic it's very sad what anya had to go through and she's like five six years old she's a child still and all of the things that she had to go through is so heartbreaking now she finally has her family but you could still tell that there's this like like they include little moments where you could kind of see anya's like anxiety um due to her past experiences with like foster with like her other foster parents and for your that little moment when at, like when they got back to their house like it was evening time and she's just kind of watched she was watching lloyd and anya and she had this like very tender expression and that's something that you're like having this family you know like something she probably never thought she would have because of the nature of her job does that make sense yeah this episode was very fun uh and i can't wait for next week's episode oh my god because it's finally it's finally the interview so we will finally get to see what aiden academy is all about and obviously we're gonna be meeting some some new faces so a lot of things to look forward to and yeah i think i'm gonna end my comments there so thank you for watching this video i hope you enjoyed watching this video um if you have any thoughts or comments please feel free to leave them down in the comment section and until my next video then bye